We're at a museum I used to go to a lot as a kid and it's so cool. Like, look how awesome this is. Ah, exciting. <laughs> ugly such as life <laughs> we're on our way back home oh my god the car is like packed full we're gonna listen to tom felton's uh autobiography i'm very excited passionate audio presents beyond the wand the magic and mayhem of growing up a wizard written and read by tom felton drive has been very uneventful so far i hope it continues to be uneventful book is really good i want a book from all of the harry potter kids we did three or four takes maybe more and on each occasion i messed it up we're at a rest stop we're stopping for coffee hi buddy okay so thoughts on this book so far tom felton still says Potter, exactly how he said it as Draco Potter. But it's just very nostalgic to listen to, and he just seems like a really nice dude. So I definitely recommend listening to it, reading it. It's great. Did you try it? Uh, yeah, there's a uh, whipped cream on top for you. Apple pie with okay. oat milk and whipped cream. Mm, that's really good. Very sweet. What do you think of the book so far? It's really funny. Very enjoyable. Potter. Potter. <laughs> Alright, time to keep driving. It's kind of loud here, sorry. We're in D.C. today because Mike is getting his German citizenship, or rather he, he got it already. I and did it. Now we're visiting the museums because, you know, we're in D.C., might as well. And they're a free activity. <laughs> Mike's family left Germany during the Holocaust, so he gets a free pass German citizenship. <laughs> so who knows if this country goes really downhill more than it already is. We might move to Germany. That's a squirrel very close. Wait, look how close it is. Goodbye. Bye. The American Indian Museum and we're gonna grab some food because they have the best food court out of all the Smithsonian museums. I'm excited. <laughs> okay, so we got chicken tortilla soup, refried beans, and, uh, tomato rice, and we got fry bread with honey, cinnamon, and sugar on it. It looks really good. Yeah. Today's gonna be a super busy day. I have multiple doctor's appointments. I'm going to get the mold done for my tooth. So maybe I'll get a new tooth by the end of the year. I also need to finish or make at all the halo kit that Devil Inspired sent me. There's like a halo headband, some wire, a hot glue stick, and some little findings. Glue it first and then wrap it with a wire. Picture of it up on my computer. So I'm just gonna try to recreate it. I've got some Alita stuff that I need to shoot for Devil Inspired, so we went to a cemetery because it's the only place that probably won't kick us out. Take you over here so you can watch. Oh, <laughs> We're in DC again, going to some museums. Meeting up with Ophelia. It's our seven year anniversary. Not me and Ophelia, me and Micah. We wanted to go on a museum date. Yay!
unbox it. Come one, come all. Oh, does that mean it's um circus? Um, night circus. Night themed? circus themed. Yeah. It sure is. Every person has the power to change their fate if they are brave enough to fight for what they desire more than anything. Is this also? Circus no, themed? that's. Caraval. Caraval. All I can think of with this is, if you had the chance to change your fate, would, would you? you? <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Bookends. Tarot cards. The sun and, and the moon. moon. Oh, okay. these are cute. The art is always a little okay. questionable. Bookmarks. Time for the book. Tiny. Cruel illusions. Win. Win. Dot, yeah. dot, dot. Or die. So the side has these rose. Anime. Animu. It looks like Ava. Some art. This is just anime art. It's better art than they normally than they normally have in these, but this looks like an anime. Cool. Well, that's it. That's the whole thing. Do I say hello? Hello. This box. He does love these boxes. True. Every time. Every time. <laughs> Okay. Bye, guys. I'm well, excited to see how this curve turns out. <gasps> the magic. I'm so excited. Magic. Magic. Oh! Magic. That's magic. So cool. Make room for Jesus. Oh, no. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> We're taking pictures. So I made a big Instagram board of all the things I'm inspired by. One of them was a girl who has glued flowers to her face. So we thought, why not glue flowers to our faces and take some pics? <laughs> That's what we're doing. We've got my phone as the monitor there. The camera is slightly off that way. And we're just, we're trying. It's so good. Uh, oh my amazing. God, okay, one more, hold on. Amazing. Yay. Yes, the process. <laughs> we're literally just sitting on the floor. <laughs> so this weekend, we're, we're at a um, mansion in Pennsylvania doing a photo weekend and me and Ophelia are the first to arrive. We're here and we made a new friend. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> okay, give us the fireplace tour again. Well, we, okay, we got to start over. First fireplace, obviously. You got to warm up your ballroom. You go to your bigger dining room because you need two to four of those and you have another fireplace. I bet there's another one. Fun, okay, there's another two fireplaces. One, <laughs> two. All right. Oh, their motion sensor. That's nice. That's cool. Hello. What are we doing? We're having pastries. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> We're doing a guitar. <laughs> This is the most flattery angle. We're getting ready for celestial shit. Oh, I shouldn't curse on my YouTube video. We're getting ready for <laughs> celestial things. <laughs> I'm gonna be Cassiopeia. Ophelia is... I'm the moon. <laughs> Your little hand. There, there. Ophelia's gonna be the moon. Trying to get ready and put on silver stuff, but like... Cool tone makeup always looks really weird on me. What did we do yesterday? Yesterday we did a bunch of Akatar stuff and then I got so tired. Oh yeah, we did cottage core stuff in the morning and ate pastries, that was cute. We did Akatar stuff and that was really fun for like the first couple of hours. And I got really tired and then I showered and went to sleep early. Everything details. Okay, I'm gonna like use all my ColourPop stuff again. I feel like all I use is ColourPop now. They got lots of colors. It says the extra coin and here for it is like very silvery. Wait, we did Valkyries. Valkyries was fun. And then we did Night Court. And then we were gonna do Starfall, but everyone got very caught up doing TikToks. And then it got late and we had to make dinner. And then everyone just kind of died and went to sleep. The end. Now I'm gonna be Cassiopeia. And the only pictures of Cassiopeia are like drawings of her sitting on a chair, holds a feather, but then she always has her boobs out. <laughs> it is not this kind of photo shoot, so. We will not have not boobs out. <laughs> You're right, not with that attitude. This is like truly the most flattering angle I've ever filmed at. All right, well, I'm gonna keep getting ready and I have to look at my phone for <laughs> my reference image, so bye bye This is it. This is my outfit. This is my outfit for the time. This is my outfit for today. Whatever Momo O'Brien says, to fade into the mist. <laughs> Yeah, 
Hello to everybody. <laughs> we got some stuff from Ivory Sheep. We're gonna open it. You wanna go first? You can go first. <laughs> you sure? Yeah, you go first. I'm ready. Okay. I wanna see what you got. I think there's tape. tape. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my gosh, it's, it's so, so pretty. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh there's got, like, <laughs> gotta show my vlog. This one is Sophia Lace Mini Dress from Sister Jane. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Why does it smell good? It really does. It like rosemary. Look how cute this is. It's so pretty. I love the little pearl gotcha. at the waist. Look, the cat and the dress match. Mm -hmm. We've got matching. This is literally so freaking pretty. Ooh. This beadwork is like amazing. Yeah, this is so pretty. Takes this like one because I want to do like fairy core stuff. I'm like <laughs> on that Wings Club kick right now. Yes. I want to do like all the fairy <laughs> stuff. Do you want to do one? Yes. Just I like got a turn. Sister Jane dress hey. too. Hey. Oh, oh my God, God. these the cat cats. and the boxes. <laughs> and it's called the Natalia Jacquard mini dress. Oh my so God. Cool. <laughs> wait, that's so cute. And this it's is like awesome. Very okay, wait, so we've got like the jacquard and it's mini, but look at the sleeve. Put on one sleeve. Yeah, we'll just each have a sleeve on. This is good. Yes. This is really exciting. nice too. We're gonna have a fairy picnic. <laughs> <laughs> this is so exciting. And I own this dress. Yes. So we can literally be twins. Yes. We so can be twins. No, literally, the reason I wanted this was because I saw you wear it. I was like, I love that dress. It's good. You have a red cape. We can wear red capes and just drapes through the floor. I'll make a red cape. <laughs> oh my gosh. That is so beautiful. It's so pretty. I hope it's good. <laughs> I was pushing the sizing on this one. It's but so like, beautiful, it's though. Fine. But I size down in mine fit. Okay. There's so uh, much fabric. <laughs> We're just disappearing here. I'll grab one sleeve. <laughs> Yay! I got a selkie too. I'm so excited. It's gonna be so cute on you. We're gonna have so much fun. Yes. In the woods. You want, you want sure? It's the little toe beans you for me. Oh little yeah. Pretty you toes. See his little toes? Oh no, he's gosh. like, I don't want to show anybody my toes. Those sweet. are my toes. Why do you have to be just out of frame, huh? So it's just nice that it's, oh my gosh, to match baby bat. That would be the thing. See, I can cosplay as your cat. Are we done? Yes. Here's the dresses. Sister Jane, Selkie. Oh wait, skip that way though. There we go. <laughs> I feel like I'm a princess. We look like sofas in a good way. <laughs> just like sofas. Oh my gosh. Gray, and then the flowers were kind of muted. This is the exact pattern of my parents' sofa when I was a kid. I'm this kidding. is a famous painting, dude. I don't know, I'm telling you, this is the pattern of my parents' sofa. This Maybe. is literally hanging up in the like the National Gallery of Art. <laughs> I've never seen it. I went to art school, but I skipped the art history class. But I also feel like this would look cool with armor. That would really look cool like with armor. armor. Yeah. The one thing I love that it. could improve selkie dresses quite a lot is pockets. having pockets. That one might have pockets, my next one. A pocket there. <laughs> I think my phone would fit in here. There is nothing <laughs> else fitting in here. Nothing <laughs> fit in there. Uh, normally I get an extra small or small. This is an extra extra small because this was the only size I had left. I was like, I'm gonna risk it. And it works. Oh, the cotton, <laughs> it's perfect. It's a little tight, but it works. So yeah. good enough. Like, so I think people could fit into like a three range size. <laughs> they can. Thing. I can wear a large or an XL. I can't size up, but I can size down with anything cotton. It's the rule of thumb. Go up a size for a gamza and maybe down a size for cotton. Let's try on the other dresses. Swap brands. I have a slip lining. <laughs> I wouldn't have been terrible if I just flashed your skin. Flashed everywhere. Romeo and Juliet. Oh my gosh, yes. The Baz Luhrmann Romeo and Juliet with Claire Danes. Yes! Oh my gosh, yes! That's what this looks like. Oh, my oh God. I love this. Wait, thing. This has like three layers. I feel like a cupcake. We gotta go to like an art museum. Yeah. We need to just be art. Oh, I'm gonna show you the eyelet up close and personal. Thank you, Ivory Sheep. This yeah. is the best. I'm living my best fairy core life. Yeah. All right, that's our unboxing. Thanks, Ivory Sheep, for the stuff. Thank oh, I you. guess like this oh, no. is a weird angle. <laughs> Thanks, Thank Ivory Sheep, for sending us stuff. We're also going to be taking a bunch of photos and making TikToks and like doing all that stuff. Yeah. I wanted to also include them in the vlog. Hopefully, I get this up before the end of February. I love it. I think you can do it. Thanks. I believe in you. Thank you. Okay. Mm. Hi. We got a box from Try Treats. This one is a little bit different and it's not themed after your country this time. So it's more of a surprise. I don't. I looked, I took a sneak peek to see what country it was, but it's not a country, so I can't remember anything that's in here. We have a discount code, Minjalinji. I thought they changed it, but it's Minjalinji still, I guess, for 15% off your first box. 
the box of snacks. Oh yeah, I was gonna say we should guess where we think they're from and then you can look it up to figure out where it actually is from. Good call. We're doing this more like the beauty YouTube this time because um, we're low on time today. Seriously strong peppermint. I don't like mint. It's probably one of my least favorite flavors. I don't like mint flavored or peanut butter flavored desserts. Or what like about cheese. mint peanut butter flavor? That sounds like the worst thing in the world. Oh no, <laughs> it's toothpaste. It is toothpaste. Mm -mm. Nope, because it's produced in the Netherlands. Sugar, maize starch, porch, pork gelatin, and flavoring. That's it, that's all that's in there. It's, it's yellow. It's dragonfly. Is that Chinese. No, I was gonna lick it and give you the rest. I don't know if I like it. That's fair. Looks like a ricola. It tastes like a ricola. Dragonfly. Tastes like a fortune cookie. What? It's better than I expected it to be. I thought it was gonna be like lemon candy, but it tastes like a fortune cookie. Yeah. That one's very interesting. That, I think this is the weirdest one we've gotten in any box. It's a hard candy that tastes like a fortune cookie. I figured fortune cookies taste the way they do because they're like a bread product. And I didn't think that you could distill that into a hard candy, but you can. <laughs> Oh wow, I look not cute today. Baby Bat will make up for my lack of cuteness with her cuteness! Yay! Just pretend this is Baby Bat's face over mine the whole time. Oh, she's such a tolerant girl. Come on, come on. This one says this. Is it like a wafer? What this looks like. Okay. It is a chocolate this wafer. This is a chocolate wafer. That was pretty good. Red, white, and blue, so it could be France. U.S. France. If it's not the U.S., we would know what it is if it was the U.S. There's a lot of places that use red, white, and blue too. Brazil! Oh! Next one is Tokito. I'm gonna guess that this is South America. Okay. Yeah, yeah. All, everything's in Spanish. It's much chewier than I thought it was gonna be. I've got Switzerland, Brazil, and Australia. Maybe it's another Brazil. Custard! Big guys. Custard? Uh, it, it's from Lote. <laughs> so. So Korean. You know what that is. Look at that. All right. Looks it like looks egg. like it's got eggy in it. Mmm. This is the best one so far. You know, very light, sweet. Royal Grand Dragonfly. So this one I think is also from China. Wafer rolls. Delicious coconut cream filling. The other fruit. That's a coconut. That's also a coconut? It's like a young coconut. We've had this same discussion before. Have we? <laughs> yeah. I was in Hawaii with my parents. Some parts they like just have big coconuts and they'll patch it the top off of it so that you can just drink like the coconut water out of it. That's I sent awesome. you a picture and you were like, what was that? Coconut. It's a coconut. And I... then we had this conversation again like in the past year. <laughs> Someday I'll remember what a coconut looks like. <laughs> this is what relationships are like. <laughs> I like I'll see right through it. I like wafer rolls. Coconut. Mm. So, so far. That's great. Wafer rolls, then the custard, then everything else, and then the mint. Yeah, that's fair. That's my ranking. This is artificial chicken flavor. That's okay, it. so this is from Meow Meow. It says it's from Malaysia. It is the texture of shrimp chips, but with the flavor of chicken ramen. Right. I think that this box was probably my least favorite of the ones we've gotten just because I like the themes. I like themes, but the candy is pretty good. This one was definitely the weirdest box we've gotten though. So if you're looking for trying weird stuff, this definitely was that. Oh my God, I've got so much work to do. So back to it. Me. Gonna go do that. All right, bye. Oh, what a good girl. What a good girl. Okay, bye.